My dad grew up very poor. I think it made him feel like he probably had to like grow up a little early and try and like protect his family. He had one sister and her name is Deanna. My brother and I always had a really close relationship and we got along really well. We were brought up Missionary Baptist, which is a conservative Baptist. We weren't allowed to go to dances. I was not allowed to wear jeans for a while. Being a cheerleader, I couldn't be. I wasn't allowed. So that's why I gave my daughter, Amy, freedom of anything she wanted to do that I was not allowed to do. I'm Amy King. I was the, the crazy cousin. So I'm Dylan King. I'm just a supportive husband, that's all. <laughs> Everyone asks me if I'm gonna have this many kids, and uh, that's a no. <laughs> Amy isn't the same way as us, but we still like her. <laughs> I am Jim Bob's niece. I'm the oldest out of all the kids. I literally grew up on camera. It is a constructed reality. You know, you have to get the angles right. You walk through a door 20 times. If they miss part of an interview, you have to look a certain way. So it's like, oh, it's the same day. Like it's, it's reality, but it's not. <laughs> <laughs> the way that I was raised was rock and roll. You know, this is life and enjoy it. Teenage years was Jonathan Taylor Thomas posters on the oh, wall Lord. and in sync and all the boy bands and I got to have pool parties and there are boys. I had my first boyfriend when I was eighth grade. Have you ever kissed a guy? Yes. Sorry, I'm Michelle and Uncle Jim Bob. But I loved my cousins and I loved my family. I was over there every day. This is how like country we are. During recess, I would literally sneak into the cow pasture and go across the field to see them. But every aspect of their life was completely different than mine. I didn't know what they were being taught. You know, I just knew they were homeschooled. At a young age, you realized really quickly that it was a very strict household. You know, you couldn't turn on the radio. They don't have TVs either. Yeah, or TV. Um, you know, my mom used to call them when there'd be like a tornado warning. Uh, we've had numerous lightning strikes. Because they had no way of knowing. You know, they had pantalooms underneath their dresses. And those I were considered. I don't even know what that is. Pantalooms are white cotton pants. Pants under a dress? But they're not just pants, okay. they're, they're billowy. You can't wear shorts. You can't show your shoulders. You just knew that you just didn't act like your, your actual self. This is my niece, Amy. I love her very much. I was there at her birth, and uh, it's amazing. Now I'm here at your baptism. I know. And the name of the Father, Son, and the Holy Ghost. I admired my uncle. He was a father figure in a way to me. Back then, it was just like, oh my goodness, what, what can't this guy do? I just remember thinking, is he gonna be president? Like, what, how far is this gonna go, you know? 